Number 5. Curb Stomp. The Curb Stomp was a finisher made by the now injured former WWE Heavyweight Champion Seth Rollins. Arguably, I see, a move which targets the head and with increased attention in being paid to concussions means they chose to remove that move from common use, which is why Seth Rollins has changed his finisher to Triple H's pedigree, which is a bit controversial, as you will later find out on this list. Number 4. Airborne The Airborne was a finisher that was used by former WWE wrestler Evan Bourne. Also known as the Shooting Star Press, you can see why it was banned by the WWE after Brock Lesnar was already a high-risk maneuver due to it being in the top rope variety, but the fact that it's very easy to either over or under rotate combined with an inability to see where you're landing just before impact meant it had a significantly higher chance of causing an injury. Number 3. Orton's Punt Kick Arguably his most dangerous move, Randy Orton famously introduced his punt kick for his storyline, which put wrestlers out for a few weeks with serious head injuries. Again, WWE's official policy stated, a move which targets the head and with increased attention being paid to concussions should not be used, and that's exactly why they chose to ban the punt kick. WWE decided it probably wasn't a good idea to promote one of their top stars deliberately giving other wrestlers head injuries in this age of increased awareness of the dangers of concussion. Number 2. Pile Driver. A classic finisher, and possibly the very first move ever explicitly banned by WWE after a mistake by Owen Hart accidentally broke the neck of popular wrestler Stone Cold Steve Austin, the injury put Austin on the shelf for a year at the height of his popularity, and likely led to his retirement at a relatively early age. The reason it's so dangerous is that the opponent's head needs to be firmly tucked between the attacker's legs, or you risk severe damage to the opponent's neck and spine. Nowadays, the only wrestlers who are allowed to perform this maneuver are Kane and The Undertaker, who only use this move in a slightly safer version, which is the Tombstone. Number 1. Original Pedigree The Pedigree is the finisher used by the current WWE World Heavyweight Champion Triple H. It is a legitimately dangerous move, as it drives a wrestler face first into the mat, whilst hooking the arms to prevent them from cushioning the blow. One mistake could be the difference between performing this move correctly 